Again, this is teacher Marlo and today we are going to use Venn diagram in solving word problems. Let us start with example number one. A group of 25 high school students were asked whether they use either Facebook or Twitter or both. 15 of these students use Facebook, 12 use Twitter and 2 use both social networking sites. Questions Letter A How many use Facebook only? Letter B How many use Twitter only? Letter C How many use both social networking sites? So for you to be able to determine what is the exact value for the Facebook only, for the Twitter only, or for the both social networking sites, we have to use the Venn diagram. Okay, so let us draw a Venn diagram. We have two um, sets, therefore we need, we need to draw uh, two circles, two intersecting circles. And then we have to enclose that by a rectangle. Now let us name our circles as F for Facebook and T for Twitter and outside of that regions will be our universal set okay now let us begin at the bottom of our problem there are two students who are using both social networking sites so both will be here two students who are using Facebook and Twitter. Next, 12 use Twitter. So we know that there are 12 students who are using Twitter. And that will be here in this region. So we have already 2, just add 10 to make it 12. Next, 15 of these students use Facebook. Again, we have already 2 here because this includes in the or this includes on the number of the students who are using Facebook. So we have already two, just add 13 to make it 15. Now we have to um, add all the numbers here in our Venn diagram. 13 plus 2 plus 10 is equal to 25. So there are 25 students who were surveyed. Let us go back to our question. How many use Facebook only? So for the Facebook only will be here in this region. Okay, so let us color that first. So that we will be able to identify the number of the students who are using Facebook only. And there are 13. Number 2 or letter B. How many use Twitter only? So for that Twitter only, it will be color or it will be colored with green. And there are 10 students for the Twitter only. Letter, letter C, how many use both social networking sites? So for the both Social network insights will be here in the middle of our two overlapping circles. There are two students who are using Facebook and Twitter. Number two problem. A group of 50 students went in a tour in Auckland province. Out of the 50 students, 24 joined the trip to Boracay. 18 went to Hinuktan Beach, 20 visited Hawili Falls, 12 made a trip to Boracay and Hinuktan Beach, 15 saw Hinuktan Beach and Hawili Falls, 11 made a trip to Boracay and Hawili Falls, and 10 saw the three tourist spots. Letter A, how many of the students went to Boracay only? Letter B, 
how many of the students went to Hinuktan Beach only. Let us see how many joined the Hawili Falls trip only. And let us be how many did not go to any of the tourist spots. Okay, so the problem is um, a little bit complicated because we have already three sets. We have Boracay, Pinuktan Beach, and the Hawili Falls. Therefore, we have to draw three circles. One. Two. Okay, three. The three intersecting or three overlapping circles. And don't forget to enclose our circles with a rectangle. Okay, now let us represent our circles with letters. So for the Boracay, it will be represented with the letter B. Boracay. Then, Hinugtan, Hinugtan Beach, letter H. And Havili Falls, letter J. And outside that circles will be our universal set okay so to solve these problems we need to start at the bottom of our problem 10 saw the three tour spots so there are 10 students who saw three tour spots the Boracay, Havili Falls and Kinugtan Beach so there are 10 students next 11 made a trip to Boracay and Havili Falls. Boracay and Havili Falls will be here. There are 11 students. So we have already 10 plus 1 to make it 11. 15 saw Hinuktan Beach and Havili Falls. Hinuktan Beach and Havili Falls is equal to 15. So we have already 10 here, just add 5 to make it 15. And 11 made a trip to Boracay and Inukan Beach. 11. Or 12. 12 made a trip to Boracay and Inukan Beach. So just add 2 to make it 12. Next, 20 visited Havili Falls. So for the Havili Falls, there are 20 students. So in this region must be total to 20. So we have already 10, 5 and 1 and that is equal to 16. And add 4 to make it 20. Next, 18 went to Inuktan Beach. So for the Inuktan Beach will be here in this area. So 10 plus 5 plus 2 is um, 17 and just add 1 so that will become 18. 24 join that trip to Boracay. So for that trip to Boracay, there are 24 students. So in this circle will be the number of the students who go to the trip for Boracay. So 10 plus 1 plus 2 is 13 plus 11 is equal to 24. And out of 50 students. Okay, so just add all these numbers inside our three circles and subtract that from 50. And the answer is... 16 meaning there are 16 students who did not go to any of these three tour spots and that is why we write that here in our or outside the circle 
Now we have already put all the elements in our Venn diagram. Let us answer our question. Letter A, how many of the students went to Boracay only? So for the Boracay only, we have 11. Okay, 11 students. Next, how many of the students went to Hinugtan Beach only? Hinugtan Beach only. We have one, only one student. Let us see how many joined that the Havili Falls trip only. So for the Havili Falls trip only, we will color that with blue. So there are four students for the Havili Falls only. And how many did not go to any of the tourist spots? Of course, there are 16 students who did not go to any of the three tourist spots. 16 students. Okay, so diba madali lang answeran yung ating uh, mga questions by using the Venn diagrams. Number three question. A pet store keeps track of the purchases of customers over an 8-hour period. The store manager classifies purchases as containing a dog product, a cat product, a fish product, or product for a different kind of pet. He found that 83 purchased a dog product, 101 purchased a cat product, 22 purchased a fish product, 31 purchased a dog and a cat product. 8 purchase a dog and a fish product 10 purchase a cat and a fish product 6 purchase a dog, a cat and a fish product 34 purchase a product for a pet other than a dog, cat or fish Questions How many purchases were for a dog product only? How many purchases were for a cat product only? How many purchases were for a dog or a fish product? How many purchases were there in total? Again, this is hard for us to identify what is exactly the answer in every question. So we are going to use the Venn diagram. Three circles ulitayo because we have three sets. Dog product, cat product, and fish product. Okay, one, two, and three. Three overlapping circles. And don't forget to enclose that by using rectangle. Okay, so let us name our circles. Dog will be represented by letter B. Cat. That is C and F for fish. And outside of that, three circles will be our universal set. So now let us um, go back to our problem and we have to start at the bottom kasi pag hindi tayo nag-start sa bottom of our problem mahihirapan tayo na i-identify kung ano yung exact number of elements in our set okay so let us start 34 purchase a product for a pet other than a dog cat or fish so notice the word other than so main meaning it is outside of our circles so 34 will be written here next six purchase a dog a cat and a fish product so that is uh, found here in our three intersecting circles there are six 
purchases. Next, 10 purchase a cat and a fish product. So for the cat and fish product, there are 10 purchases. So we have already 6 plus 4 to make it 10. 8 purchase a dog and a fish product. So for the dog and fish product, there are 8 purchases. Just add 2 to make it 8. 31 purchase a dog and a cat product. So dog and cat product must be equal to 31. So 31 minus 6 is 25 to make it 31. Next, 22 purchase a fish product. So for the fish product, there are 22 purchases. So in this region must be equal to 22. We have already 6, 4, and 2, and that is already 12 plus 10 to make it 22. Next, 101 purchase a cat product. So for the cat product will be here in this area. 25 plus 6 plus 4 is already 35 plus 66 to make it 101 and 83 purchase a dog product so that's this must be total to 83 25 plus 6 is 31 plus 3 is 33 plus 50 to make it 83 okay so we have already put all the elements in our Venn diagram now we can easily find out what is the answer in our every question first how many purchases were for a dog product only so again for the dog product only that is equal to 50 We have to color our Venn diagram so that it is very easy for us to identify what is the exact number of elements in each region. Next, how many purchases were for a cat product only? So for the cat product only, that is equal to 66. So, diba? Mas madali lang sa atin na ansiran yung ating mga questions with the use of band diagram. Next question, we have how many purchases were for a dog or a fish product? So for the dog and fish product, it is uh, here in this region dog and fish product that is the union of our two circles or two sets set B and set F so just add all the numbers that you can see in the color blue region 50 plus 25 plus 6 plus 2 plus 10 plus 4 is equal to 97 therefore there are 97 purchases for a dog and a fish product for a fish product next how many purchases were there in total so just add all the numbers that you can see in our Venn diagram so we have already um, 97 plus 66 plus 34 is equal to 197. Okay, so diba? It's very easy for us to understand or to answer the following questions if we know how to use the Venn diagram. Sometimes, mathematics is complicated, but always remember to be positive